Hello, me hearties. A very, very good evening to you. It's just me, Scotty McClue. Welcome, welcome, welcome to our live chat. And we're live streaming on TikTok just for you and say dinky do. Always good to have you with us, of course. So much to talk about and so little time to do it in. So do come and join us as quickly as you possibly can. Let's get started. How fantastic would that be? And a very, very warm welcome to you, I say. In Rev 2, Tony boy, it looks that way. Yes, indeed. If you're into all that, hello, says Heno. Hello, Heno. Lovely to have you with us. And diggy do, diggy do from California. We love you in California. Welcome, 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 I say, to Scotty McClue's TikTok. And we are live saying diggy do to every single one of you. Uh, you can stop scrolling as soon as you see this because this is TikTok's top talk show. So fantastic stuff, that, isn't it? Beautiful, beautiful. I'm Scotty. Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, the first lord of the internet, and the world's most humble man. Hi from South Africa. Wonderful. Love the show and enjoy all your content. I thank you so much. Hello. Dinky do. Hi Joe. Hi. How are you doing? Dinky do. And a very, very warm welcome to you. Wonderful stuff. Now then, do join us and please follow because we're very short on followers, although we've got half a million viewers. Incredible stuff. Absolutely incredible. Join Join us as soon as you can, follow, follow, follow from the off and uh, share as many as you can of these lives and also please like and share the videos because they're there for your edification, education, enjoyment and delight, I say to you. Wonderful stuff. Now, um, what we're talking about tonight, you've probably heard about the wonderful landslide election for Scotland. So Scotland could be on its way to India independence. How amazing is that? Incredible. Incredible happenings going on after all that uh, terrible lockdown and awful pandemic that we had. Hey there, young chap. Dinky do, I say. Uh, I'm from the Isle of Mull in the Highlands of Scotland. Dinky do, we love the Isle of Mull. Are you from Tobermory or are you from Salon or Dervig or are you from... Uh, where are you from? Fina Fort. Wonderful stuff. Stupendous. A lovely Sunday evening with Scotty McLean. Magnificent. Alfonso Bellafonte. We always love to see you. Bella, bellissimo. Si, si, Alfonso. Hello, lad. Sending hugs. Dinky do. Cuddles and kisses. What's missing? Dinky do, Tyler. Can you please say hi to Amelia? Amelia Grace, we can always say hi to you from Scotty McClue, Dinky Doo. Uh, from Birmingham, the first one, says Thomas. Is this your first one, Thomas? A very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, and this is big style. Wonderful stuff. TikTok's top talk show. And I am Scotty McClue, just for you, reading out your comments, giving you all the very best stuff. Fantastic. From Birmingham, here's to a free independent Scotland from the Irish here in Belfast. Wonderful stuff. You're amazing. Just remember that this is everywhere on this live. Oh, yes. Oh, you're amazing. Uh, and to everyone on the live. Guys, you are amazing. Fantastic. We love that. Diggy do. I'm from Essex. We love Essex. Fantastic. Do you know Basildon? There we go. Hello. 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 There's a wee troll there. We Kim doing a wee troll by Kim. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> You're amazing. You're amazing. Thank you very much indeed. Favorite part of Irish history. Oh, all of it. Fantastic. Going right back to the start. Can you say hi to Marie? Of course I can. Hello there. Hello there, Nathan. Dinky do. Bye. Speak to you later. See you, Thomas. All the very best. Take great care of your wonderful self. Lovely to have you on with Scotty McClue Live, the one stop broadcaster, first lord of the internet. Hi to the Ruby Moon. We love our Ruby Moon. Follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. We're very short on followers, very, very big on viewers. Very, very successful TikTok live. You're old school, oh, old school, but very, very new in my thinking. Very interesting. Hi to Alaska. Dinky do Alaska. Lovely to have you with us. That's cool. Say hello to Alex and Matt. They love you absolutely. Free Palestine. Oh, I didn't realize you paid for it. How is that? That is wonderful. What are your pronouns? We never ask pronouns on here because we're far too modern for that. 
You see, far too modern for pronouns. We're all inclusive. Favourite whiskey? Well, I don't drink alcohol. So there you are. So that's that. Hi, Sunset Dinky Do, and lovely to have you with us. You're watching Scotty McClue. We're live on TikTok just for you. This is the big one. Incredibly happy my viewers showed me your videos. You're such an amazing, kind person. Thank you so much. I love TV. Can you say hi to Sadie? Of course I can. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. Very much appreciated. Uh, get yourselves on here, guys. There's JD. Hi, Scotty. Did you hear that? Um, oh, yes, yes, I did hear that, Paul. Yes, but I won't, I won't say to everybody because we're up here with all the depressing news and we want all the positive stuff on here. Unity is strength in the world of dubious. Favorite make of tea. I think I love the Arrow Grey. I'm big on the Arrow Grey, and I love Yorkshire tea. Fantastic. You start selling your badges and donate the proceeds to charity. There we are. Well, I haven't got any at the moment, but I will when we can. It's my birthday. Amelia, happy birthday to you. Lovely to have you on here. Uh, who have we got here? Uh, are you religious? Uh, well, I'm a child of the universe, and I appreciate all religion. Love you, dinky-doo. Thank you very much. Do we got here? How's your day been? My day has been quite outstanding. I got a washing done today, so I was quite chuffed with that. What do you think of the new referendum discussion? Very interesting. I mean, they should get on and have it. You know, I mean, we'll get our answer. I've put, check out my uh, videos on TikTok. And you'll get all your answers there. Um, it's interesting when people come on here, they ask me questions. They say, it's all on TikTok. Everything's there for you. Are you from Nigeria? I love the accent. Yes, indeed. There we are. We're all Africans. How much do you pay for a haircut? Oh, round about five pounds, usually. Fantastic. You sound like the dude from Harry Potter. Ah, excellent stuff. There is the outstanding and very, very wonderful Maria Knight sending me TikToks. Is that not beautiful, guys? Maria is the most generous person in the world. She's given me thousands and thousands and thousands of TikToks. And I just love her for it. I just think she is incredibly kind. It's so good. Kyle, you never ask anybody who they voted for. So never, ever, ever do that, la. Hi, Scotty. Scotty, I'm at Prestwick Beach. Karim, are you walking the dogs on the beach at Prestwick? If anybody's on the beach at Prestwick, give Karim a wave. Maria's giving me all these TikToks. Thank you, Maria. So very, very kind of you. Happy Mother's Day. I thank you. I can't believe it's Mother's Day already. Incredible. It really is. Mm. Dinky do, Scotty says MSM. MSM, lovely to have you with us. And Dinky do, Maria sent me one hundred TikToks. I love you, TV has sent me TikToks as well. Dinky do, thank you so much. And I love you, TV sent a gift box. That's so beautiful of you guys. Thank you very, very much. I'm saving up for some new equipment. I've just got uh, myself a little tripod, and we're in the library at McClue, McClue Towers. Favorite alcoholic beverage? None. So uh, I'm just a water man. I don't drink. So there we go. For Sarika, Nico should be London mayor. There we are. Do you think so? Well, I think that... Uh, it, it will be absolutely spot on. And, of course, uh, in outside London, I don't think anybody does anything about that, do they? Can you do your Susie impression, Emma? Say, right, you be civil. That's it. Uh, look, they've put me through. Well, they've no right to put you through. Well, uh, now, look, don't you start. <laughs> That's how was that? Uh, Maria sent me a diamond king. Maria, that is stunningly beautiful. It's just flashed up in front of us. You are so kind. Guys, please, please give a clap for Maria because she has given me thousands and thousands of TikToks. She just wants this to succeed. 
She's an absolute hero or a heroine, I would say. A new background, Scotty. So there, we're in the library at McClue Towers. That's where we are. Get the squeeze box out, Scotty. Not yet. It's far too early. We've just started. Guys, if you're scrolling and you've just joined TikTok's Top Talk Show, stay where you are. You are watching Scotty McClue. Like all the videos and follow me. We need a follow fest. Hey, from the UK. Far do you bide? Uh, not too far. Absolutely. Uh, how would you take it if Scotland had another referendum and lost again? Well, it's not a question of losing. It's a question of what do the people want? And uh, I suppose we just have to have another go later. Uh, you look younger with this background. Oh, thank you very much. Have you had an Aberdeen Angus for dinner? Oh, yes. Well, actually, I have, believe it or not. I have had an Aberdeen Angus. It was burgers tonight. Can you say hi to my friend Piper? I can, Evelyn. Yes, absolutely. Glad to see you again, dude. Dinky do. Guys, can you all share the video and follow me, please? Scotty, I thought you were in a bed set. Did you use the TikToks to build an extension? No, this is part of the bed set. Yes, the other side's got the books, you see. There's me and the books, and I sit on the bed. Wonderful, but we call it the library. Because you can turn round, it means you've swung yourself round to the library. Is that not rather good? Dinky do. Bagpipes out, Scotty. There we are. I'm watching your checks expand. Can you see them? There's my checks. There they're expanding. <laughs> Fantastic. We love all that. Follow me as soon as you come on, guys. We're very, very busy tonight. But uh, we, everybody on TikTok should be following Scotty McClure. If you've got a TikTok account, you should be on here live with me. This is very important. Did you get elected? Well, I never stood. Do you think I should stand? Would you like to see Scotty McClure in Parliament, guys? Do tell me. And a steak pie and totties with sprouts. The sprouts are starting to ferment. Yes, stand clear. Best DJ of all time, 90s legend. I thank you. I used to listen to you on Hallam FM. Must have been 25 years ago. Yes, it'll be 24 years ago. I'm pretty sure, something like that. Can you play the harmonica? I can. We don't like the new background. We love the new background. Yes! Do you like it? The library at McClure Towers. Do you vote? Of course. Yes, who would not vote? People died to get the vote. So we should be voting. Vote, vote, vote. My mother, my grandmother was a suffragette, and my mother was called Christabel after Christabel Pankhurst. How's that for a background? Follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. Very, very important. So there we are. London, 1910. Well, this is London, 1908. She got married in 1910. Woo! I'd vote for you, Scotty. Thank you, Dick. Mmm. Do follow us as soon as you come on. Ujib, you've put, I hate, never ever hate anybody. Vote for Scotty McClure. Thank you, Stacey. With an IE, remember? Uh, fantastic. Don't you get tired of talking so much? Well, I don't talk very much, Justin, to be honest with you. I just have the odd wee chat. Was it no Emmeline Pankhurst? No, Emmeline was her mother. So there you are. How about that, Alco? You get your education on here from Scotty McClure. There was Emmeline and then there was Christabel. Yes, you check that up and you come back, you tell it. There we are, somebody from Somalia. Lovely to have you with us from Somalia. Are you a politician? I'm not, killer, no. I'm apolitical. But I am an uh, economist and uh, I uh, study international affairs. All these things. Are you not a fan of the hard water? Notice you've none in your glass. No, Hollywood, I don't drink alcohol. I gave it up about six, seven years ago. Can't remember how long, and that was it. I'm a dirty, stinking pirate. Oh, on guard, and we shall fight you off the ship, me hearties. <laughs> who do you vote for? Killer, you never ask anybody who they vote for. That's their private business. So there we are. You don't do that. So there we are, hard water and ice. Is that what you do, Hollywood? Are you into the fire water? Yes, indeed. That was the stuff, wasn't it? Hi from Timbuktu. Yes, indeed. Can you say hi to my mother for Mother's Day? Yes, I can. Hi to your mother for Mother's Day. Dinky do. There's somebody else saying, who do you vote for? Uh, so I am a man named Scott. 
I have just watched the videos from this morning. Glacier. Brian Blessed sure looks different. Light. What a lovely thing to say. He's a fabulous actor. Hi from Northern Ireland. Thanks for having you. Thanks so much for the shout out. Not at all. I love TV. I love UTV. I love UTV. I knew all the people at UTV. I used to work for UTV. Dinky do, Scotty. Hello, young chap. There we are. Now, um, UDJ says, big up the Irish Republican Army. Are you joking? They died the day Lord Mountbatten died. That was the end of them. Scotty, they had, we went to the cake shop, but there's no lemon drizzle to be found. Shakaroni, you're breaking my heart. There should always be lemon drizzle. Was there any Dundee cake? Right, tell me about that. There's I, Miss Obama, saying, up the Royal Artillery. That's the British Army, the Royal Artillery, the Gunners. Obviously, in the Gunners, a gunnery officer, I say. So there we are. Now, uh, no, 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 you're totally wrong there, UDJ. I don't want to ban you, but less of that language on here. I will have to ban you. Remember, Mountbatten was the only man that could have helped you. There we are. So there's no doubt that was very, very, very the worst thing that ever happened in the 20th century. I'm from Ternant, says Stacey. Do you hear? I got it right there, Stacey, didn't I? Ternant. You see, Trenent. Yes, I used to drive through it every night on my way out to the Saltoons. What about that? Is that not amazing? All right, so there we are. Right, UDJ, I think we'll have to dump you because your politics are just wrong. Totally wrong, okay? Your queen loves your country and has come there and uh, seen you all. And all you should say is, God save the Queen and God save Ireland. The two are the same. All right, so there we go. Uh, you look like a young Lord Nelson. Oh, thank you very much, I say. I see no ships. I see no ships. <laughs> so it's wonderful. Now, who we got here? Wonderful stuff. Scottish independence. Yay. Boo says UDJ. Well, no, there you are. So what you say every single night, when you say your prayers, you say, God save the Queen and God save Ireland. All right, la. That's you sorted. Did you hear? We'll have to dump you for that, I'm afraid. Chain, you've had to go for trolling. Oh, I trolled. Chain trolled. Charlie trolled, long live Ireland, long live Ireland, and God save the Queen, UDJ. You go and practice that. I know every blade of grass in Ireland. I could tell you the true history of Ireland. And the man who started Sinn Féin was a great monarchist. What about that? Yes. Do you think the prison service is working? Um, the prison service does a fabulous, fabulous job. Um, I don't think it's ever really been firing on all cylinders, but uh, I think we've maybe become a little lax with our punishment. So I think if you say stole a dog, you should get life imprisonment. If you take money off somebody as a bad, bad person, then I think life imprisonment. Yes, absolutely. Now, who have we got? Right, you, DJ, you're not really fit to be on the planet, so we'll say bye to you. Very, very bad man. we are gone. Lovely. Right, he's off. Okay, fantastic. Uh, Spotacles, I had lasagna. Dinky do. Now, what have we got here? Vicky's just joined us. That is fantastic. If you've just joined us, you're watching Scotty McClue. We are, of course, live on the big one. Sunday night, nothing gets past me. Wonderful stuff. There's a lack of funds for prisons. Yes, I think so. There was no Dundee cake, says Shakaroni. Jesus loves you, man. Jesus absolutely adores me, and I adore Jesus. So there we go. You're sounder when you're sleeping. Oh, yes, yes, I sound fantastic when I'm sleeping. Absolutely no doubt about it, Jose. Wonderful. Now, who have we got here? Uh, we've got Dermot joining us. Welcome, 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 I say. You're watching Scotty McClue. Welcome to the world's top TikTok. This is the top TikTok talk show. Can we please have the Pinocchio impression? We can. So, when a certain politician stands up, 
in a certain House of Commons on a certain front bench and tells us something, Pinocchio, Pinocchio. I was wondering if we should change the titles of parties and one of the parties should actually be called the Pinocchio Party. What do you think, guys? Should Boris be the next king? No, no, we've got a queen who's outstanding. There we are. Boris is not in that league. So there we are. Down with Corbyn. Why are you saying down with Corbyn? He's an outstanding human being, and he very nearly won the election with the Labour. What about that? Uh, there we are, you see. So I would say up with Corbyn. I think they should maybe ask Corbyn back. What do you think? Should he come back? Mm. Oh, that's lush. Absolutely lush. Dinky do. Wonderful stuff. Now, uh, I'm a UDG in an alternative account. So big up Ireland. So if you're bigging up Ireland, then you big up the Queen and the monarchy. Yes, they all go together. Yes, I think the Irish crown is still part of the English crown and the Scottish crown, to be quite honest with you, because you chose the old republic, you see. So there you are. So big up the Queen and big up Ireland. And don't do yourself down to that extent. And don't say such foul, filthy things that you do say. Get your act together and look into it properly. You've had your head stuffed with nonsense. Big up the custard creams. Absolutely. Do you like Labour? Well, I, I'm not political. I don't dislike them. But they're not actually Labour, if you see what I mean. The last time, I mean, the Labour Party effectively died on the 1st of May 1997. When they were taken so far right, they actually got elected. See, the UK quite likes the right wing all the time. That's why they keep bringing in the Tory party. So you maybe need another party that's quite right wing to put the Tories out, if you see what I mean. That's the only way you'd do it. What's your opinion of Margaret Thatcher? Wonderful lady, excellent politician, shockingly bad for the country, very good for London and for the city of London, shockingly bad for the country, shockingly bad for Scotland. She sucked the life out of Scotland. Oh, and the north of England. I don't know why they're voting Tory. I suppose because there isn't really a, a credible opposition. You see, had Labour not betrayed their roots in 2014, the lady running Labour at the time could have been the first... Uh, the First Minister of Scotland. So there we go. Incredible stuff. Right, there we are. I'm not going to read out uh, negative comments about wonderful people. Uh, so there we go. So Killer Burger, nah, absolutely not. Nobody is. So drink water. Yes, absolutely. What have we got here? Up the Cherry Jaffas. Is that, a, is that a movement or is that a biscuit? In fact, who needs Ireland or Wales either? Just unify all under one England. I'm not sure that the Irish would go for that. Irish guys watching, would you like to come back under the crown? What about some hard labour? Greetings from Holland. Hi, ya. Come into Hooseville, cup of tea happen. Lovely, lovely. I've got mine a clumping on. Are you Scottish? Yes, I think there's a bit of the Scot in me. There's no doubt about that. Do follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. Very short on followers, but very, very, very big on uh, on viewers. There we are. Uh, Wales and Ireland are their own country. They should be able to make their own decisions. Well, I think they do, Dickie, more or less, you know. Um, I love the Tories, says Killerberger. Good for you, Killerberger. What do you love about them? We were clomping the whole day. Johan, I, when I was 12, I'd visited Holland and got a pair of clomping wood, wood clomping, Wood, yeah, and um, I learned to ride my bike in them, and I wore them. They were very, very difficult at first, and a little bit sore on uh, across the top of my my feet on my top of my arch. But uh, see, when I got going with a clomping, very comfortable. And I used to come in at night and slip my feet into my clumping. There you are. Did you learn to ride the buggy in them? Uh, oh, no, that was a bit dangerous because, you see, you could have planed the wood down. 
Little chips of, of stone used to go into the wood. Are you from Afghanistan with the beard, young chap? That's it. You got me. Yes, indeed. Can we tap your nose? Tap, 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 tap on Scotty's nose. How fantastic is that? We love it. Thank you. You're all very, very kind, I say. If you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. There's talk of Ireland rejoining the Commonwealth. They should do. Because, I mean, all that trouble stuff is over 25 years ago. Okay, there's a few thugs acting up. You'll always get that. And uh, they get their heads stuffed with nonsense, you know what I mean? The grass is greener on the other side. All that kind of nonsense. Up with Boris for King. Yes, indeed. Well, of course, we've got our monarchy, so Boris has probably gone as far as he can go. There we are. That's what I can tell you there. Who's your favourite band art in Scotland? I think uh, Jimmy Shand. Without a doubt, I love Jimmy Shand and his band. Scotty, I was outraged. No lemon drizzle cake either. Bye, have a good day, Killer Burger. You take care. ta la What do you think of those pesky French fishermen? Well, I mean, we should never, ever have left the EU. That was the biggest act of self-harm since the First World War. Scotty, you're also African as well as Scottish. Yes, we all come from the African Rift Valley. You're right, Shakaroni. I always tell people that. Now, there we go. What have we got here? Um, I've got some very strange people on here. There we go. Absolutely. Right. Toast with all that nonsense. Okay. Now, uh, what's Air like? Air is an outstanding, beautiful town. There we are. All dear, wham ne'er a tune surpasses for honest men and bonny lasses. Maria, you are so beautiful. Thank you for giving me so many lovely, lovely presents. It's just overwhelming. Overwhelming. Even Scotty, guess who it is? Is it Long John? Bojo doesn't want to be one recorded in history for Scotland leaving the Union. Well, I'm afraid that's what may happen. So, you know, he'll need to, uh, he'll need to look good and say, no, no, we don't mind them leaving the Union and start to work with us. I heard Michael Gove saying he wants to work with the Scottish government. David says you should meet Maria. Maria might not want to meet Scotty McClue. So there was, she might not want me to know who she she is. She's just a wonderful benefactor. She reminds me of great expectations. There we are. What career did you pursue? I pursued television and radio and theater and TikTok and education. A riddle for you, Scotty. I travel over the world. I always stay in my corner. What am I? You are A clear light. You're a clear light. A pure, clear light. Whoever has McClure as the market, yes, will the House of Commons know? Yes, Maria has given me 170 TikToks. Maria, thank you. You're so wonderful. A compass. Ah, but why would a compass be in a corner? Can we make a big inflatable Scotty with a thumbs up and a dinky do speech bubble? Yes! Boo! <laughs> Terrible streams of Scotty. There's somebody that must have been banned and made a new account to come out and say that. Move on, everybody. The answer was a stamp. Ah, stay in my corner. I was thinking of you in your small corner and I in mine. Remember we used to say a little song called Jesus builds the shine with a pure clear light Like a little candle burning in the night In this world of darkness we must shine You in your small corner and I in Mine. Do you remember that? There we are. You'd host the radio show. I, if you'd host a radio show, I would gladly listen. When I hosted a radio show, we had quarter of a million people listening every half hour. Now, we were on for six half hours. You do the math. Maria is at 320 TikToks, Maria, thank you so much. Please sing a Scottish folk song. Yes, I might. Very impressive how you have evolved over the years, moving from radio to TikTok. It's time. Modernizing. Well, Long John, I think this might be the future. 
You know, if we can get the word out there, there should be nobody with a TikTok account not watching Scotty McClue right now and not following. So it's up to you guys. Big up Ireland. We've always bigged up Ireland. Ireland doesn't need bigged up. Long live Ireland and God save the Queen, says Scotty Still. There we are. Still going. 600 on the feed. Fantastic. Do you support the black and tans? No, I actually thought they were shocking. And I was very, very angry for Winston Churchill for doing that. I uh, knew of a family called the Fitzwilliams, and the Fitzwilliams are very, very big in Yorkshire and uh, over in, um, oh, the other side. Anyway, I can't remember, but, uh, down south, yes. They're very, very big down there, down Peterborough Way. And they're a very, very, very old British landed family. And one of the Fitzwilliams was in Ireland in the 1500s. And I think he was the Chancellor or the Viceroy. And he got sent back. He got recalled for being too pro-Catholic. So what about that? So no, I do not support the Black and Tans. I think they were a disgrace. But... Perhaps at the time, with the IRA coming into being, they did need a firm hand, you know what I mean? What is four letters sometimes has nine, but never has five? Oh, MSN. Maria Knight is coming up to 550 TikToks. Maria, how do you do that? She's operating with both hands and sending me two sets of TikToks. Can you see that? You support it. No, we've done all that. Uh, do you support terrorists? No, certainly not. Certainly not. Certainly not. Scotty, I've told time to tell, time to tell, time to see if you knew me. You'd never, ever even ask these questions. I'm very big on looking after people in the world. Scotty, how are you doing? Can you give my dad, Tony, a shout out? I should maybe do a phone in in Ireland and start talking sense to people. Guys, who have you got here? Fantastic. Maria, 700. Maria's got two streams going for giving me TikToks. Guys, are you watching this? Scotty, how are you doing? Can you give my dad, Tony, a shout out? I can't, Aaron. Scotty, I think Wonky wants a block. Can you do that for him? Yes, we might. Unify Ireland into one Britain, says Elmis. There we are. I don't know that they want that. Uh, no, don't unify into the UK. So there we are. Uh, Scotty Steele, you need to be a bit more thoughtful in your comments. These comments sound that you're maybe needing some outside help. Yes, absolutely. Do follow us, guys. There we are. Uh, now Scott is saying big up Ireland and big up the Queen. Fantastic. Unify Ireland, end of story. Right, there we are. Now, Scotty Steele, I'm afraid that these people finished 23 years ago. <laughs> You're living in the past, love. There we go. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll dump you. Fantastic. Good. He's gone. I don't want all that negative stuff on a very, very, very positive talk show. In fact, the most positive talk show in the world. Maria has got 1,000 TikToks with both hands going. The second that reaches 250, she's got 1,000. Maria, you've done it. Thank you so much. Very kind of you. There we are. Ireland's free. Ulster's Irish. They're free, Scotty. Everybody's free in Ireland. Stop all this free this and free that. There we go. Uh, Sonny in the go this evening. Why are we talking about Irish politics? I'm not your hand. I'm just touching on them because I've got one or two dafties coming on who don't know Ireland. You know, that's what's interesting. Which DJ created the McLuhan Megamix? Uh, I think it was a wonderful DJ called Daryl Denham. So there we are. Fantastic. One of probably the best DJ in the country. So there you are. What about that? Uh, who's that there? Dylan, what you're saying there is known as trolling. You need to go. You're a troll. What a shame. Right, there he goes. Maria, you're way over a thousand TikToks. Buddy, how are you doing? We're fantastic. Good evening from Hamburg. Yeah, 
Ähm, guten Tag! <lacht> Nicht Deutsches sprechen, ich bin ein Ausländer, ich verstehen. I say to you, what's your favorite biscuit? So I've got so many, so many, too many to list, I say. Who have we got here? Oh, Bennett, dinky do. I thank you. Fantastic. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Always good to have these people on. Love the positivity. Good evening from North Korea. El Miss Obama. You can move at some speed when you want to. Uh, thank you. So Maria, Maria's given me, she's coming up to 1,500 TikToks, guys. Can you see that? 1,500 TikToks on top of thousands. Maria, thank you so much. I'm going to watch this go to 1,500. If you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue. We are, of course, live on TikTok just for you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. When did you start TikTok? I joined TikTok itself about a year and a half ago. But I didn't start doing lives till about five weeks ago. Maria, what are you doing? She's giving me more. She's already given me thousands. Are you from Glasgow, young chap? I am. And you're from North Korea. Amazing. Hands across the sea. Bye. Bye, Kilberger. Take care. Kilberger, you said bye about half an hour ago. <laughs> I can't believe you're still with us. Squeeze box. I don't have that one. Best five weeks for TikTok. Johan, do you like it? Is it working the way it should? I adore the people that come. You obviously get a few wee idiots, right? You're going to get that. They don't understand. They're not mature enough to handle the stream. You have little trolls. They ask the same question of every live. That's all they know what to do. Now, there's a lot of converts who say, I started trolling you and then I started watching you and I love it now. And I've banned hundreds of them. I might let them back on. Why the change of background, Scotty? Oh, uh, we had to move some stuff around tonight. So there you are. Um, what's your thoughts on the British and Irish Lions squad? Fantastic. We love them, Miss Obama. There we are. What happened to the squeeze box? Is it out for repair? No, no, the squeeze box is actually somewhere else. It's out of reach. I would need to go and get it. <laughs> Hello from Armagh, Scotty. We love you in Armagh. Welcome, welcome, I say. I can't believe it. So there we go. Yes, indeed. Now, we can't have anything like that because that's just not true. So wait a wee minute. There we are. You have to go. You're only going because of your handle because it's just a lie and we don't allow lies on here. And remember, Scotty doesn't hate at all because hating would shut off an avenue of learning. Remember, I know every blade of grass in Ireland and I know every single bit of history. So there you are. You're talking to an expert. So don't be cheeking up and don't be making a disgrace of beautiful Irish people by being a figure of hate. All right. Scotty, do you think that the exploration and habitation of humans on Mars will be successful? Well, I noticed that there was a very, 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 very man that's got a lot of very, 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 very much money talking about offering tickets to space. This was an account you binned five minutes ago. There we are. Well, there it goes. It's binned again. <laughs> Double binning for somebody who should be in the bin. What do you know about the Troubles in Ireland, Scotty? Every last detail. Right back to the Republican Brotherhood. Right back to the 14th, 15th century. Back to the 10th century. I mean, all the old Scottish kings. Remember that Christianity in Scotland came from Ireland. You know, it's uh, we're all from Ireland, actually. But uh, the trouble should never have happened. The army have to go in where the politicians have failed. So don't look badly upon the army because um, uh, they're only following orders from the politicians. And politicians don't always understand how good the military actually are at their job. Would you take a ticket to Mars uh, and space? Scotty McClure out of this world. Well, I'm out of this world anyway, apparently, when a minute, according to you lot. So there we go. So I don't know about that. 
Mm. That is absolutely lush, guys. So there we go. Now then, hello from Wales. Ayakida. Lovely to have you on from Wales. Winging, says Elvis O'Banner. Are you, Elvis O'Banner? Are you flying? Are you winging? Oh, this is the captain speaking. <laughs> I like that. Now, what have we got here, guys? Come on, as soon as you possibly can, because we have lots to talk about, so little time to do it in. Can you see the titles of the books? Maria has just showered me with uh, a gold mine. Oh, Maria. Maria, how do you solve a problem like right, Maria? Up the Prince of Wales. Yes, he's a great guy. Who got voted in in your constituency? Ooh, uh, the guy that was actually in it before. Uh, yes, indeed, I like a Picasso book. Excellent, thank you very much. Maria, what can I say? Thank you so much for your beautiful, beautiful gifts. What's happening with the radio, Scotty? Haven't heard a thing, Jonesy, so I'm assuming that, uh, you know, there's been a problem. Both the IRA and the Brits were in the wrong at the Troubles. Yes, I think that's right, Pablo, but it's all very well. If we had an honours degree in hindsight, we could say that, you see. But uh, the, the, the truth is the Troubles shouldn't actually have arisen. You know, that's the problem. So I spy a Heritage of Britain book. Can we see a few pages? Oh, shakaroni, there's everything there I could tell you. That's just the start of the library. Scotty, what's your favorite book in your bookcase? And can you show us? I have so many favorite books. You know, it would be very difficult to show you. Um, so there we go. Maria has sent over 20 pounds, or I think she sent a lot more than that. I would think Maria sent hundreds of pounds, if not thousands. You go to George Square with the thousands of Rangers fans. Well, no, you see, I don't follow football, so I wouldn't know whether Rangers were better than Celtic or Celtic were better than Rangers. You know, it's that sort of idea. So we don't know. It's just one of these things. There's a wee halfway going down the swanee. Everybody watching. Here he goes. Hey. <laughs> I'm eating a kebab, so there we are. I'm sure I'll need a shower afterwards, it's magic. I know, Tommy, you get the salt sauce all down your face and the salad and all that stuff. So there we go. Fantastic. Right, who else have we got here? Um, Scotty, do you think... Long John Terry, I can't really make sense of that. So there we are. Yeah, we banned the dad account right away, half-witted idiot that he is. You know, we can't have that on TikTok's top live. These people need to grow up. Come on, have some respect, be civil, keep a civil tongue in their gob, or go down the swanee as toast. Now then, if you've just joined us, a very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, the World Stop Broadcaster and the First Lord of the Internet. And we are, of course, live, big style. We've got about another five, ten minutes. Let's use it well and wisely. Uh, lots of sharing. Scotty, are you Irish? Well, we're all Irish, Fallen Fox. I have a mental health and I am sad, but I'm okay. We send you love, Peter. And uh, remember that mental illness is not a weakness. It's a sign of staying strong for far too long. There you are too. I'm Irish too. We're all Irish, every single one of us. We come via the African Rift Valley. Then we went to our various countries around the world. We are the Diazapora, Diazapora. <laughs> are we all Irish? I don't believe that. No, Elvis Obama, start believing. We came, we're actually all African. So I'm an African, you're an African. We're being watched by fellow Africans. Everybody in Ireland's an African. You know, that sort of idea. So I don't know why they're fighting at all. And I was thinking today, what makes somebody say, this is my country, not yours? Every country is everybody's. That's why we should never have come out of Europe, because 70 million people 
lost or got robbed of their EU citizenship just to satisfy a handful of Hurry Henrys who didn't want to pay the tax. Shocking, they are. And of course, you were all what from the back? The bricks of tears. Yes, I know the African connection better than any Irish blood. Everybody's got Irish blood. I'll tell you who's got a fantastic bloodline is Prince Charles, the Prince of Wales. Very Scottish very everything it's just it's just got an amazing bloodline it's just outstanding fighting over nationality makes so sense no there should never be any trouble anywhere do you know what i mean here here i'm anti-brexit too totally agree with you on brexit yes it was a shocker brexit was the biggest act of self-harm this country's ever done to itself but uh, those that brought it through just don't care about britain they're not interested. You know, they only care about their pals not paying the tax. But I have German and Dutch heritage, Scotty. How am I Irish? Well, you'll have a bit of Irish in you as well, you see. A bit of German, a bit of Dutch, all that. It's fantastic. I mean, you look at the Queen. Queen's got a uh, little bit of German, a little bit of European, 50% Scots. Her mother was 100% Scots. You know, I mean, it's fantastic. Bye for now. Have a good evening. Peter Parks, we send you strength. The wonderful Georgie Parker has sent me beautiful TikToks. What a lovely, lovely man from Harrow. We love Harrow. So many Dafties have stumbled on this intelligent stream tonight. Yes, but they'll either have to ship up or ship out. That's all, Shakaroni. George Parker, thank you so much. That is very, 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 very generous. Hello from Ireland. We love you, the real Giga Chat. We love Ireland, and we say dinky do. How are you today, Scotty? Hello from Edinburgh. We love Edinburgh, what a beautiful part of the world Edinburgh is. And dinky do to you, I say it is tremendous. Lol, lol, absolutely. So there we are, lots of lol. Um, you don't need to big up Ireland. Ireland will big up itself. Remember, Ireland is much, much bigger than you. And peace in Ireland is way beyond your, your IQ of one. Yes, Scotty, I'm actually named after a town called Brody. Whoa, look at this halfwit here. I'm going to do something bad to you. You've done something bad to yourself. You haven't got yourself an education. <laughs> These halfwits. Uh, Scotty, I'm actually named after a town called Brody, who was in Austria, Hungary, but now in the Ukraine. Long John, how fascinating. I love all this stuff. This is a beautiful, beautiful stream, apart from the odd halfwit, like that, uh, all that stuff. Uh, do you know Peter Piper who picked a peck of pickled pepper? Yes, indeed. And I know the very pick, uh, piece of pickled pepper that Peter Piper picked. What about that? So there we go. Now then. We'll just say cheerio to you FN fans on trolling, trolling the world's top talk show. I think not. <laughs> Down the swarry with that one. There we are. Greetings from Finland. Hi, Scotty mate. We love the Finns. Scotty mate, how's your Sunday? It's beautiful. There's my favorite man in the world. Susie babe, lovely to have you with us. And dinky do. Now then, uh, come and join us as soon as you possibly can. You're watching Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, the first lord of the internet, and the world's most humble man. We're in a new place tonight. Can you spot it? No one trolls Scotty McClue and gets away with it. Absolutely. Yes. Nobody, nobody trolls the Spanish Inquisition. Scotty, how much wood could a woodchuck chop in a woodchuck chew chop wood? Oh, quite a lot, I would think. Where's your education, old boy? It's all here, old boy. We're very big on education. What's not the story? I see what you did there. Beautiful Sunday. Absolutely, Shire. Never a problem. I'm coming to your home. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Typical Irish temperament just to disrupt. Yeah, well, not very wise, I think. IQ of one. There we are. But what we'll do with them is send them to the Swanee. Are you watching, guys? Troll going? Troll alert? No. Ray. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic stuff. Right, now then, 
A very, very warm welcome, Scotty McClue, of course, and here we are live on TikTok just for you. Sunday night, nothing gets past me. <laughs> Always good to have you with us. Yes, the troll's gone, don't worry, you ha. These are idiots. Scotty, I'm in love, the nice, I love the nice trim tapered beard. Makes you look very professional. Long John, you're very, very kind. I would like to think I am a professional. I'm very sad they don't have anything better to do but Jason, they're very attracted by all you intelligent people. They would love to. Have you ever seen a wee one that can't play the piano thump a piano? That's what that wee troll's doing. He would love to join in the live properly and say something intelligent, but he can't. Yeah. So let's have a bit of sympathy for those who are not as smart of ourselves. Scotty, what's your opinion on the whole Harry and Meghan debacle? Well, I'm just wondering, perhaps I don't want to be harsh on the royal family's choice of people, but I don't think they should let people in who don't understand what's involved in being royal because it's a very, very tough gig. And, um, you know, she should certainly not be... Uh, calling any shots, and she should certainly not have done that interview. I know they did it for the money, but they shouldn't have done that. That was very bad news. Absolutely. So there we go. So I'm afraid my opinion of her just plummeted. You know, when you look at Kate, what an outstanding lady Kate is. You just, and then you've got this chalk and cheese thing. No, 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 no. Scotty, where can people find your videos? Uh, the page with a subscribe button or in the YouTube channel. Yes, you'll see the link for Scotty McClure's YouTube channel beside my profile, right in front of your face. Am I right, Shakaroni? It's right in front of people's faces. But Scotty and Megan didn't want the pressure that comes with fame. Why did she become an actress? Oh, no, no, no. She obviously loves the fame. And I think she handles the pressure very well indeed. You know, I think that obviously it looks to me like this has been planned from the start. And she set her cap at Harry. And then thought she'd start calling the shots, you see. If George the Sixth didn't abdicate... Who would be monarch? Well, George VI didn't abdicate, you know. Uh, it was Edward VIII who abdicated. So there we are. Leeds, yes. Yes, of course, you're right. Uh, we just need more people to know about the YouTube channel. So you can see it in front of you, okay, Shakaroni? Right, everybody click Scotty McClure's YouTube channel, and there's 1,400 videos for your edification and your education and your enjoyment and your delight. We love that. Fantastic. Uh, now, oh my goodness, it's half past eight. Uh, have you ever been to Leeds? Yes, I used to just stay down the road unknown. I stayed just between Sheffield and Leeds. It was a 20-minute journey if it wasn't rush hour. Straight up the motorway. Yes, we can see it perfectly. Dinky do. Scotty, I have a challenge for you. Can you name all of Henry VIII's wives in order? I don't know that I could do them in order, Long John, off the top of my head, but I could try it. You've got uh, Jane Grey. You've got um, Catherine of Aragon. You've got Anne of Cleves. That's three. You've got um, Jane Seymour. Is that right? That's four. You've got, um, who else have we got? Henry VIII's wives. Uh, we've done Catherine of Aragon. Catherine Parr. That's five. And um, who else have we got? Catherine of Aragon, Catherine Parr, Jane Seymour. Um, have, have we got uh, Jean Grey? Oh, I've got one more to go. Catherine Parr. Uh, did I say Anne of Cleves? Did I say Anne of Cleves? Is that six? Can you teach us some Scottish? Yes, I'm teaching you Scottish now. Just follow me. Uh, answer, answer what I ask. Anne. Anne Boleyn. Hooray! <laughs> Is that all right? Have I done it, Susie Babes? There we are. I had to recall, you see. And knocking on a wee bit. I used to be able to just 
reel them off like that. Because you've got to remember, when I started in television and radio, there was no internet, no phones, no search engines, no Google, none of that. So I had to learn and learn and learn every single scrap of knowledge and then tell you all that at night on the radio. What about that? What was your career? Television and radio. I used to do three-hour phone-in programs on national radio. There we are. That was me. You're a wonderful man, Susie Babe. You're a wonderful lady. You just triggered my memory there. Anne of Cleves and uh, Anne Boleyn. Ooh, that's lush. Absolutely lush. What year did you start on radio? Uh, Scotty McClue phone-ins were 29 years ago in about uh, eight weeks' time. Yes, yeah, six weeks' time, six, seven weeks' time, 29 years. So there we are. I set up radio stations 30 years ago. I first went on television in 1984. And uh, I started my first radio station. I built my first radio station when I was nine years old. I could broadcast on it. And my dad could hear it on his car radio in the garage. <laughs> the bears go into the woods. So I believe, Shakaroni, the wonderful, outstandingly stunning, amazing, beautiful Maria Knight has just given me some more TikToks. Oh, my goodness, Maria, that must have cost you a fortune. Scotty, we need you in Toronto. Druske, could I go on the radio at night? Rich in Root has just sent me five beautiful red roses. Thank you, Rich in Root, top man. Uh, Scotty, please keep my dad in your prayers. He's in hospital right now. I will, Sean. I will do that. The whole world watching Scotty McLean on TikTok will keep your dad in their prayers. It's very inspiring to see someone who's so passionate about their job. Well, Long John, I mean, you could not be. You know, if you love what you're doing, you'll never work a day in your life, I can tell you. I've never done a hands done. Hello from Iceland. We love you in Iceland. Dinky do. Uh, and a fabulous shop. Can you hum a song as the squeeze box is out of bounds? Uh, I'll maybe do you Donald McLean's farewell to Oban. You need to talk about hockey. There we are. Oh, yes, absolutely. Well, you know, I had a relative who was a trainer for one of the big ice hockey teams. Absolutely fantastic. Ice hockey. I need to get to know it. Can I talk about the hockey cocky? <laughs> fantastic. You put your whole self in, your whole self out. Your whole, no, enough of that. Right. That's not, why you, that's not why you got in touch with me, is it? Right. Here we go. Dee 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 How's that for you? Donald McLean's farewell to open. Fantastic, because we don't have the squeeze box. Well done in overcoming your addiction to the hokey cokey. Yes, yes, I put myself in to a clinic and I took myself out and I turned myself around and that's what it's all about. <laughs> What countries have you visited? Lots and lots and lots, but not nearly enough. Awesome. Thank you, Scotty. Guys, I'm going to have to dash. Been wonderful being with you this Sunday evening. Please follow me. Please like every TikTok video. I will be making you some new stuff. Get on to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel and start loving the videos on there. Until then, this is Scotty McClure thanking you all for watching, telling you to stay fabulous and be yourselves because it's a lovely thing to be. I say to you, dinky do, good night and God bless you. I'll sing you the goodbye song. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. A vita zain, au revoir, and a cheerio. Dinky-doo, guys. Love you lots. 
Goodbye. Woo!